Uh, I saw he was running straight, and then he broke out. I just broke, broke on the rock. Seen the ball, picked it off. That's it. Uh, I mean, it's a big difference, uh, especially playing with Petrie, Jimmy, Steve. You know everybody. Uh, we all communicating. We all flying around out there, just having fun. Yeah, that's my dog. He, I call him Superman because he here all day. So yeah, that's it's good having somebody like him back down, and then you know he can look at Jimmy to help him if he needs something. So I mean, that's yeah, that's good. How much is having Jonathan Joseph helped you out? Oh yeah, he, he talking to me almost every play. It, it, it mean a lot because you know he played a long time in the league. So if you playing a long time, it mean doing something right. So anytime you got something to say, I you know I'm listening. You look like you gained a work, spent a lot of time in the weight room in the offseason, didn't you? Yeah. What was the purpose? You said, what was the purpose? Yeah. I mean, you know, I like to hit, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, yeah, that's why. What do you weigh now? Still the same weight. What does a healthy season look like for next few years? Uh, I mean, just flying around with everybody else on the defense. That's it. How much of that work after practice with guys one on one? What, what's kind of the conversations there? How much, how much value is that when you can you know, sit and talk with the guy? I mean, you know, we are teammates, so we want, we want the best. So I'm telling them, I'm telling them what beat me, and they telling me what beats them. You know, so I mean, it, it's what's, just working. What's the value of having a defensive coach as your head coach, but also a guy who is less than a decade removed from playing the game? So yeah. What's the value of having a defensive-minded coach as your head coach? I mean, it's you know it's a big thing. Uh, I mean, he know what he's talking about. He relate because he's young. Uh, he always got energy, and he want us to have energy too. So, I mean, it's good having a coach like that, somebody who who relate. So yeah. Can you go about his philosophy on pressuring defense? It seems like interceptions like those can come from that too. How does he explain pressure and how where what's quarterback's relationship? Uh, what? You talking about the press within the defense? Yeah. Say it again. What? Well, so what? How can how can this defense force turnovers? Oh, I mean, yeah. I mean, anytime you put in pressure, the ball come out quicker. Uh, so in, in the back end, we gotta know what's going on. Uh, we gotta know what the quarterback wanna do, where he wanna go. First read, last read, all that. And then. Once we lock into that, you know, we're going to get the ball. You do talk about the relationship before last season. What do you think about all the attention he got last year? Who? Sauce. I mean, you know, he having fun up there. I'm, I'm doing my thing, talking to my teammates out here. I mean, it's, it is what it is. He, great season for him. Uh, great season for a lot of other rookie corners. Uh, you got kid in Kansas. You got, you got the Bills. You got, you know. We everywhere, so everybody, everybody just having fun. Everybody doing their thing. So, is there two more. You got better man, better man player. You and Jake. Me, for so actually, act, nah, you, you gotta ask them too. <laughs> you gotta <laughs> ask them, ask them who wins. Better. <laughs> I'm better. I'm better. I'm better for so. <laughs> you got to see Will Anderson in college. See his advertise so far in practice. Oh yeah, he, he a dog. He, he gonna be different. He different. Last one. How, how does this uh, defense fit your skill set? Uh, you know, I get to be at the line of scrimmage. I get to be off. I, you know, I'm doing everything. So, uh, I feel like around the ball a lot more. More plays we made. So, we'll see.